What's going on fellas, it's Cage and I am back for yet another video on Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I've just been so excited about this game, so I thought I'd go ahead and try to pump out a lot of videos on it because I've been trying to like dissect all of the information that we've gotten on the game thus far and try and figure out more and more about the game. I know a lot of you guys have probably been doing that as well. And there's one uh, thing that I wanted to share with you guys right now. So as you saw in the Direct, if you watched that, there is a new thing called Echo Fighters, and those are like sort of addressing uh, clone characters in a way, except they're not really the same thing as what many people refer to as clones. And I'm going to get into what I mean by that. So if we take a look at the fighters here on the website. If you guys want to access this website, I'll put a link in the description below. Uh, really cool website. It has like information on every single character and even a short video clip with all of them. Like, let's take a look at a character that has an Echo Fighter. So, if we look here, we can find Peach, and then right next to her is Daisy. So, you look at Peach, and, uh, yeah, you have this video clip here. And, I mean, we can watch the video. That's that's cool. The, the graphics are, in, are insane. That's just one thing I'd like to comment on. Um, they look very similar to the Wii U version, but uh, definitely a step up. Uh, as you can see, like, the shadowing is just so much better in this version. That's one thing that definitely stands out. But looking at Peach's moveset, I mean, yeah, that's that's just regular Peach. We, we all know that, right? Let's take a look at Daisy now and uh, see what that has to offer. So this is Daisy's moveset now. And as you see, it's literally the same exact thing. There is not a single attack that they have that is different from one another. And that one makes them... That's what makes them Echo Fighters. So, you see that? They have the same exact, not even one move. And when I say one move, I say that for a reason. Because now we're going to go back to... Can I go back to this? Or Okay, I guess that's not working. Alright, we'll just click on here. But we'll go back to the Fighters. And now, notice that other characters that you would think of as clones, like Mario and Dr. Mario, they aren't Echo Fighters. And people will still refer to these characters as clones. Uh, I made a video earlier on Dr. Mario and how his moveset looks like it's changed even more from Mario's um, in this game. But they do have a different down B and they do have a different down air. And that is not a lot. Um, you know, they also have other stats that are different too. Dr. Mario is slower and more powerful. Uh, but just that difference of one special and one aerial attack is enough to make them not be uh, the... What's it? The Echo Fighters. I, I just forgot the term there for a second. Um, but yeah, just just that slight difference. Just a single move, right, is enough to make that difference. Uh, if we take a look at other characters too, like Young Link, and then down here we have Toon Link, we could see that they um, aren't Echo Fighters, and neither is Adult Link. And now Adult Link, it makes sense because he's a lot different in this game. He has the remote bombs this time around, and he doesn't have a hook shot. But Young Link and Toon Link are pretty similar. Now, there's just, like, one key difference, and I'm pretty sure this is the only reason why they're not Echo Fighters in this game. That, right there, guys, if we look back at this, he has a Fire Arrow, and that was in Melee 2, if I'm thinking correctly. Now we go to Toon Link, and can we play the video? Toon Link does not have a Fire Arrow. See? No Fire Arrow. It, it has a little, like, beam that it shoots, like, it just shows a little bit of color effect. But no fire there. And that, I think, is the only reason why they are not Echo Fighters. So, there you have it, guys. Clone characters and Echo Fighters aren't quite the same thing. Uh, Nintendo, or just Nintendo, doesn't really consider characters clones if even a single move uh, varies between the two of them. The only characters that are directly addressed as clones are those that have the entire complete same move set and just some stats changed. But let me know, what do you guys think about this? Um, obviously, it's great that we're getting all the characters back. Do you like how clones are getting addressed? Do you wish that uh, characters like Dr. Mario and Young Link were addressed as Echo Fighters as well? Or do you think this is the proper decision to separate them? Uh, let me know all that down in the comments. And if you want to stay up to date with all my content on Smash Bros. Ultimate, I almost said Smash Switch or Smash 5 there. But yeah, guys, we know the name of this game. Uh, if you want to stay up to date with that, uh, consider subscribing, ringing the bell, or even joining my Discord server. I'll have a link to that in the description below. We could chat there, and you could stay notified on all my newest uploads. I hope to see you guys again. This is Cager, and I'm out.